Hi there, I'm Robin, founder and chief executive of D4H. Thanks for your interest in our products. This video is a high level tour of how an emergency manager could use D4H. It'll give you an idea before we jump on a demo together of what D4H does and how it can help you. Please keep a list of questions as we go along and we'll answer them in person on an individual demo with you. This is the home screen of D4H Incident Management. Our products are available through a web browser like you're looking at now, or through our native mobile applications available on Android and iOS. I'm gonna press Start New, and this brings up a list of different pre-plans for an incident. I can design these pre-plans myself in the admin area, and that allows me to have different forms, turn on different apps, have a different response structure, alert different people, ultimately have a completely different response for each of my different pre-plans. The first screen is the sit rep or situation report. All of the forms in this product are very simple to edit. Just click your cursor into a field and begin typing. There is no save button. When you're finished typing, you just take your cursor out of the field and it instantly appears on everybody else's screen on your team. This real-time collaboration makes editing and collaborating on information incredibly easy. These templates are completely configurable. We have a drag and drop form builder in the admin area, and you can choose from over 20 different field types in any layout you'd like for all of these screens. Everything we do is audited. The audit trail contains every change listed by which person in which ICS role at what time with a version history for the field. It's very easy to then share by email the contents of this report to your distribution lists. Now we know the situation we're dealing with, the next thing we're gonna do is look at the resources we need to find a resolution. We've got all sorts of different views built in here from org charts to list views. Everything is very easy to print and share. Now we've started working on our IAP. Here we can edit any of the ICS forms and build out our incident action plan for the operational period. These plans can be preloaded, but they can also be signed with electronic signatures locking the form. Once you're ready, you can print all of the forms in a single incident action plan. Our mapping has licensed and built in all of the Esri ArcGIS base map layers. This gives you satellite imagery from all over the world. Easily annotate this map together with your team to document where things are happening and places they should pay attention to. Our log feature allows you to document your actions and decisions through the mobile app or the web app. Very simple. Point and click the camera to take photographs and post them straight into the log. Our checklists allow us to mark our tasks as in progress or complete, assign them to different roles or people, and get an overview of where everybody is at. You can also create tasks on the fly and assign them to people to notify them. The entire system has integrated mapping, meaning that anything you add with a location will appear on your main maps as a layer. Build apps in here, such as damage assessments, shelter management, flood areas, etc. Use these apps with their custom templates to capture information from the field. For example, here I'm completing a damage assessment for a house. I can design and build these forms in our drag and drop form editor. Set rules that set different colors for different statuses and dashboard widgets in the header. Easily distribute your form by email. Build apps for anything. Here's a shelter management board I built. This lets me track the occupancy and capacity of my shelters. With built-in weather forecasting, we use the situation location to keep you informed about the weather coming in the next 72 hours. Use our incident reporting product to store a historical archive of all of your incidents and analyze them there for insights into your data. We'll automatically create charts maps, and comparisons of all of your incidents and training exercises. 
Keep profiles on each of your incident management team, understanding how often they're doing exercises and how often and which type of incidents they're undertaking. We'll automatically generate attendance stats, training stats, and track their qualifications. We'll automatically send proactive alerts when their qualifications are going to expire and help you manage skill drop-offs across the team. Do you have equipment that you have to manage? Use our equipment management tool to ensure that you never miss an inspection or inventory across all of your locations. Do you have any questions after that? The next step is a one-to-one -one video call where we'll go through those questions you have and tabletop out some scenarios together. In the meantime, take a look at our YouTube channel for hundreds of videos on how to use D4H and lots of customer case studies. I'll speak to you soon. Thank you very much.